Seven Sports, sponsored by Isleta Resort and Casino. Lobo is starting a three-game homestand out to build on their 5-1 and one record against Louisiana Tech. Richard Patino told us afterwards leading scorer Donovan Dent had back spasms during pregame. He toughed it out, though, and scored eight points, 10 below his season average. And returning to the lineup, Jalen House, just his second game because of a hip injury, but Jamal Mashburn Jr. replacing House on the bench with an ankle injury. So no match tonight again. Louisiana Tech starts hot. Daniel Bacho driving in for the and one for the Bulldogs. But House in his first game since the opener, making an immediate impact. Dishing to Nelly Jr. Joseph, who scores the easy bucket. Lobos would begin to heat up. Mustafa Amzil off the rebound, gets it done, and draws the foul with the N1. And Donovan Dent picks up one of his four assists to go with those eight points on the True Washington corner three. Good for an 8-0 Lobos run. And later, it's House from beyond the arc, rattling home with three. Lobos plus eight for Jalen, a strong return. 16 points, six boards, four assists. Washington playing big off the bench, turning a steal into a slam. True with 10 points. And then out of a timeout, it's House. Well, he shoots a three ball, but doesn't go. But the Mountain West freshman of the week is there for the cleanup. JT Toppin, eight points, seven rebounds. And then look at Jamal Baker Jr. off the pass by Washington for three. Baker goes six for nine from beyond, knocking down his last six shots. Lobos go into the locker room with a seven point lead. Baker leads him with 18 points in the 74 65 win. We knew early on just it was going to take a while for us to get a rhythm and, um, and just get used to playing with each other. So, I mean, we're just going to continue to get better, continue to try to get 1% better every day and, um, and continue to grow. And this win is Richard Patino's 200th as a head coach, who tried for number 201 Saturday night at 7 when New Mexico State invades the pit.